welcome to three, three insights in about three minutes. LinkedIn is a tool that is used and well, abused by many. And to get some insight about LinkedIn, I've turned to Anthony Jones. Up until recently, he was the director of digital marketing for Ducks Unlimited, and now has turned entrepreneur. He's got 37,000 followers and spoke at the 2021 nonprofit Innovation and Optimization Summit about LinkedIn strategies. Anthony, why should a nonprofit or anybody get on LinkedIn now? Yeah, Drew, like right now is what I like to call the good old days of LinkedIn. And the reason is the platform is growing by the day, but it has not become oversaturated with content. And that's not the case with other networks like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, where there's so much content, there's so much competition, your, your voice is not being heard or content's not being seen. And the numbers don't lie. There's more than 770 million people who use LinkedIn, but less than 3 million people post content on a regular basis. That's less than half of 1% of the total population. So now is the time for your content to be seen and your voice to be heard on LinkedIn. I think a lot of people simply don't know where to start with LinkedIn. How do you recommend getting started? Yeah, the, the first step is really engaging with your community. And I like to suggest everyone spend 15 to 20 minutes a day just leaving meaningful comments in their newsfeed. And uh, if your newsfeed is showing you a lot of content that's not related to your job or your industry, just do a search for your job title or something about your industry, and you'll see a lot of content really quickly that you can relate to and leave meaningful comments on on a regular basis. And by doing that, you'll be seen as someone who is contributing to the larger conversation on LinkedIn. And that's a big part of building your personal brand. Anthony, you and I both post our own content. We're part of that half of 1%. What would you say to the 99% that are, well, a bit hesitant about posting? Stop overthinking it. I mean, really, we all have stories and lessons that we've learned in our career that we can share that would add value to others. Start sharing those stories today. And when you do it, be genuine. And remember that people connect with people, not the corporate press releases or motivational quotes that people just blindly reshare on LinkedIn. And be sure you show your personality. Like that's the number one mistake that I see people make on LinkedIn, aside from not posting content, is they feel like all content has to be professional and career related, but it's the content about you that people will engage with and help build your personal brand the fastest. Thanks, Anthony. The good old days of LinkedIn are now. Give it 15, maybe 20 minutes a day and be yourself. That's great advice. Three is brought to you by marketingaccelerator.com. We believe that sharing insights leads to better decision-making and better decisions lead to business growth. I'm Drew Dinklager.